and make me really happy. If you could turn the volume up for me, please. I think it could make things just a little bit nicer for you. So what do you think? That takes care of that. Yep. But if neither of the hordes we've seen is our target, then what kind of beasts are we actually hunting for? Do you ever listen to what our instructor says? I, uh... Sorry. <sighs> we think they're invading scavengers. Scavengers, huh? Yes. Beasts that eat waste and other stuff normal beasts won't. and they travel in packs. If we don't take care of them fast, they could become a real problem. I see. They could do a lot of harm to Mark's village. Right. So let's take care of these beasts and find the Emil herbs, too. How's this? Ah! That was ah! I can't be held down here. Hey, Michelle. You were raised by your grandfather, right? Yes, in my old village. It's a ways past this hill. We ran a small clinic together. Oh, really? I was raised by my grandparent, too. My grandma. I remember you saying that. She scolded you a lot, right? Hmm. Feel free to forget that part. Um, 
Speaking of your grandma, Celia mentioned a few things about her, too. She said your grandma was really strict. She was, and she had a particular way of speaking. She'd always say, it's a Foucault's duty, and whatnot. My grandfather was a stern man, too. His saying was, I'll beat everything I know into you. He had me mixing dangerous herbs when I was only five years old, too. Oh, wow. So this is the stuff, huh? I know next to nothing about herbs, so... I'm actually glad that you're here, Michelle. Why do you sound surprised? It's our job to cover each other's weaknesses. True. But I'm glad too. And I'm relieved that we can help Mark's grandfather now. Mm-hmm. That's one of the most rewarding parts of being in Blaze. Yes, it really is. You okay? Yeah, it's just that when my grandpa died, I was right there with him. I had to watch. That must have been hard. It really was. That's why this means so much. Being able to help Mark's grandfather, I'm so glad we can do it. It makes me happy that I decided to become a knight. Hey, Michelle. I had to watch her go. My grandma. She died in front of me, too. Since then, I haven't been able to forget her last words. I try to live by them. You mean about... Yeah. She said to live nobly, so... It all makes sense now, why you're so fixated on that. Mr. Fulcott, I'm sorry. <laughs> Them? The Might be. You do seem different than the usual. I agree. Come on. Well done. I just realized if the mission was to defeat a horde of them. Excellent job. Yeah, we did it, huh, Michelle? Um, yes. Good. Um, <clears throat> In any case, at least that takes care of that. Well then, let's pick some Emil herbs and head back. Oh, look! Look where? What's wrong? That beast's mouth. There's something around it. Some herb. I think those are... 
Yes, they're breath herbs. Isn't that what Dorote was going to pick in the forest? This isn't good. No. Let's hurry back to the village. <laughs>